Now, here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. And great weather for loading that uh, truck. It was in the upper 50s, unseasonably mild uh, for this time of year. Much cooler for tomorrow. Wouldn't call Tuesday cold, but it is cooler. We take a look outside. It's a beautiful evening. Been varying between uh, clear and partly cloudy. Temps in most spots now, mid and upper 40s. Looking good in Providence right now at 47. That seems to be the popular temperature. Smithfield at 47, well, the Willimantic and Westerly. New Bedford 45 and Newport now coming in at 44. Smithfield, partly cloudy and 48 degrees. So heading out this evening, Weather looks fine. No issues with precipitation or storms. We're going to keep things quiet. Looking good for Santa tomorrow evening and tomorrow night. We'll show you that in just a second. Next system, probably not until the latter part of the weekend. Now, there may be a couple of showers on Friday. Not a big deal, but a more generous rain possible by the uh, second half of the weekend. So really now till then, we continue with the dry conditions. A few fair weather clouds have been streaming through. Here's the wider view. Uh, New England looking good. Some clouds through the upper Midwest and the Great Lakes, but really no precipitation. The bigger weather story nationally is this system across the southeast from the Carolinas all the way down through Florida. In fact, the airport at uh, Fort Lauderdale for a while was closed due to flooding rain this morning. So this storm system normally would be very concerned a few days before Christmas, a storm in this position, but this will head due east and out to sea well south of New England. Now what we can look at on the satellite picture is a water vapor imagery where we can look at uh, moisture at different levels of the atmosphere. And when we play back several hours worth of imagery, you can see how the air is spinning in the atmosphere and you can see that counterclockwise swirl. That's called an upper level low and that's just a significant weather disturbance produced the rain and the wind and the stormy conditions across the southeast, but that stays away. Locally, we're doing pretty good this evening and overnight, mainly clear by tomorrow morning, 8 a.m., waking up to sunshine, 32 to 34. Plenty of sun during the afternoon. It's not 58. It's more like upper 30s to lower 40s, but really a, a comfortable day. It's not frigid or bitterly cold. Tomorrow evening, tomorrow night, mainly clear. By 11 o'clock, the temps are down in the upper 20s. Tomorrow night actually looks a little colder than what we'll have tonight. So for tomorrow morning, sunshine and dry. Temperatures starting off between 30 and 35. Early, beautiful afternoon tomorrow with sunny skies. Cooler, but still comfortable in your daytime highs between 40 and 45. Christmas Eve night looks good. Looks good for Santa. I threw in the snow for some decoration, but there's no white Christmas, no snowstorm, uh, clear skies, colder. By midnight, the temperature is down to about 28 degrees. Seven day forecast, the dry stretch of weather through at least Thursday. Friday is not a storm day, just a shower. Kind of the latter part of the weekend will bring in some precipitation. Christmas Day, we've been saying this all along now, uh, cool and dry with a mix of sunshine. Some fair weather clouds cold in the morning. By noontime, we should reach around 40. And even Thursday, not bad. Sunshine uh, seasonably cooler with daytime highs again uh, in the upper 30s to lower 40s. Uh, just a couple of showers on a Friday. I wouldn't call it a storm day. Check back with us as far as the latter part of the weekend. Right now, we're kind of leaning towards a rain situation sometime uh, Saturday night into Sunday. Temperatures over the weekend, uh, not that bad for winter. It's in the uh, middle to upper 40s, but looking good next several days and really great timing here. This is certainly a, a busy time of year and uh, the weather should cooperate. And today I thought it was just perfect winter weather and it looks like that's going to stick around for a couple of days. At least in through Thursday and even Friday's not that bad. All right. Sounds good. Yeah. Tony, thanks.